Well, we've been telling you about plans to replace Portland's Burnside Bridge over the Willamette River. And when that happens, Multnomah County says it would be the only bridge in the central city to be able to withstand a catastrophic earthquake. There's one group that already sees this new bridge as an opportunity to revitalize Portland's waterfront. Ken Body explains in this week's Where We Live. We met Willie Levinson of the Human Access Project at the east end of the Burnside Bridge. So that little tower right there is where the stairs are. Levinson wants more people to have access to the Willamette River and the East Bank Esplanade. So there's some barriers to get to the Esplanade right now. Really, from a landscape architecture perspective as much as anything else, this just doesn't welcome you. Multnomah County says this is what would happen to the Burnside Bridge in a catastrophic earthquake. They want to build a new bridge that's earthquake ready. Levinson says it should include a ramp to the East Bank Esplanade, making the river accessible to people with disabilities bicyclists and pedestrians. And while they're at it, perhaps a terraced park like this one in Lyon, France. The magic of a river happens at the water's edge. So a lot of what we want to do is create opportunities to get people to the water's edge. A new Burnside Bridge could cost up to a billion dollars. Multnomah County has about 300 million now from higher vehicle registration fees. It's also asking the public for ways to cut costs. Recently, Portland City Council did approve $20,000 to study how much a ramp would cost instead of the elevator in the county's current proposal. Uh, replacing the Burnside Bridge is literally a once in a century opportunity to remake and reimagine the East Bank Esplanade. So it's still a long shot, but it, uh, you have to celebrate your victories. There's a lot more work ahead. The design phase doesn't even begin until next year, but Willie Levinson has hope that a new Burnside Bridge could bring new life to Portland's waterfront. Ken Body, Coin 6 News. All right, you got to be patient though with all this. Multnomah County says the new Burnside Bridge could be completed by 2029. That's assuming it does get federal infrastructure dollars. Meanwhile, though, they're asking for your thoughts regarding design and the cost. We've got a link to that online survey at coin.com.